Uh, Mary Kay Cabot tweets this out. Uh, Tony Fields in a walking boot, uh, right foot. JOK not in pads today, apparently just resting full padded practice. Um, obviously, JOK not concerning. Uh, anybody in a walking boot, um, a little bit concerning because um, you, you certainly want a guy like Fields. Fields is a guy that has been banged up pretty much his entire career. You just want him to be healthy. Well, you're in this odd position here with the Browns. It's probably only going to be five of the linebackers that maybe make this team. You know JOK is going to make this team. We know Jordan Hicks is going to make this team. And then you maybe get to about four guys who are essentially maybe competing for three spots. And that certainly would be Tony Fields. It would be Devin Bush. It would certainly be Ma, uh, Mamou Diabate and the rookie uh, Bookie Watson. You know, you think Tony Fields, who probably has the most experience, at least within the Browns, and certainly playing for – um, you know, Jim Schwartz last year, he would probably have the inside track to spot number three. Um, you know, if this lingers, uh, I'm not saying it's maybe going to cost him his roster spot, but maybe there's a chance he you know, has to go on maybe a short term IR type of thing or something. But it's it's not the best thing for Tony Fields, you know, for right now. Tony has been a guy who's been able to contribute in defense. You know, I mean, I'm sorry, in special teams and on the as the years have gone on, you know, when there was injuries to Anthony Walker or injuries to Sony Otaki Taki. That is when Tony Fields kind of found his opportunity to get on the field a little bit more. Um, now he's in a position where he might as a guy might be leaving the field for a little bit and sadly maybe creating the opportunities for other guys. And, you know, certainly for Devin Bush, you know, a guy trying to resurrect his career. Um, you know, Bookie Watson trying to make a name for himself. Mahmoud Diabate played really well for this team last year on special teams. And if everybody remembers, he was really good in base defense last year. So it wouldn't be surprising if, you know, Diabate was a guy that found his you know path to significant playing time. But it hurts Tony Fields in the respect that you have probably four guys competing for three open uh, final 53, you know, linebacking spots on this roster. So hopefully for Tony, it's not that big of a deal. It's not that long. You know, and it is, you know, it's getting kind of early late, so to speak, because the Browns do play their first preseason game in about nine days.